Good morning. Good morning. Oh, oh yeah. I got a grace. I'm jumping in now. We got too much to cover. Good morning, everybody. Thank you so much for being here. It is a most fantastic time. And Mexit is this week. Yes. Woo! Yes. It is. It is this week. It is this week. I'm had to say this a few times because people coming in. None of you know where you are speaking at. Nobody. It's on purpose. It has nothing to do with me behind. Everything is so top secret. I can't even tell you where you're speaking at because it's tied into something else. All I can tell you is, Phil, you're early in a prime time spot. You'll know within 24, 48 hours, okay, as I finish a few things. This is how it's going to work. There, first off, you should be at Mexico. Let's start there, okay? You should, you should absolutely be at the Mexico conference. Ashley, make sure that we know everybody in said attendance, okay? Make sure of that. Now, I've got an idea we're gonna do. All of you are gonna get, everyone needs to make sure that you are Ashley or Grace's friend on Facebook. Important. Ashley, Grace, or Monica, we need to be one of their friends because we're going to do the Mexican conference a tad bit differently because there's a lot of streaming and live happening all together. Those of you who are speaking, which is not that many of you, you're going to be on uh, get used to StreamYard, not Zoom. Okay, get used to StreamYard, not Zoom. You'll be presenting through StreamYard. As soon as you, well, that'll be a conversation for me and Ashley. So be ready for that. Now, that being said, you're gonna need a good strong Wi-Fi spot. You're gonna need that obviously. And all of you who are doing Mexit news things, that will stop temporarily on Wednesday on Wednesday, okay, on Wednesday. That does not mean it stops because it's gonna pick right back up Monday, okay, <laughs> right back up Monday. You just don't want to, we just need, we need the stream yards. There we go, yeah, we gotta need the stream yards and we don't want to collide because we have some practice runs that we need to do. Okay, practice runs we need to do. We need to, you know how you, before you get to where you're getting, stage left, stage right, right? You understand what I'm saying? Yeah, stage left, stage right. There are, so I'm gonna start all over for everybody to understand what's going on here. Mexit is this week. Let me read these messages. What about, you, well, I don't know, you tell me. When is your team? Wednesday, are you like recording on Wednesday? Now, uh, well, then it stops on Wednesday. All Mexit news stuff stops on Wednesday temporarily, picks back up Monday. Okay, which is a good thing for Renee and Prophet Jerry because they're getting married this week. Yes. They're getting married this week. Absolutely. Yes. Yes, yes, absolutely. They are getting married. Yes. So if you are someone like the private messenger who's saying, can we stop today? Yes, you can. That's the yeah, I grown. You sure can. Yeah, more if you want to, if you want to get some in to Wednesday, because I'm Stradivari group is killing it. I don't know what to tell y'all. They, <laughs> they might, they, they killing it so much. I have moved them and they don't even know it. And y'all don't know. Yeah. Stradivari group, Stradivari group. I can't tell you. I can't. I let, let yeah, you, you let. I had to do what I had to do with Ashley Group. I had to do with Stradivari Group. Yes, yes, they killing this so much. I had to do that. All right, let's make something. This makes sense. Mexican conference is May 14th and 15th. It starts at 8 p.m. Excuse me, 8 a.m. Central Standard Time. It ends whenever I feel like ending it. Right, it has no time to end. That could be five. That could be six. That could be seven. There's so much depends on that as both days, because some of you are in different countries and speaking from different countries. So you're going to want to know when it starts and what time you need to be up in your time zone. 
for instance, you got Pam Norris in Hawaii who already asked me, you got Steve in the UK, you have Ibrahim who is actually speaking in Abu Dhabi. So there's a bunch of places. So 8 p.m., 8 a.m. Central Standard Time, convert that into your time zone. That's when Nexus starts. We will start on time because I don't know another way to be. Okay, <laughs> you will miss some stuff if you do not show up on time. You have a full opportunity. You automatically get the video for life. Automatically get the video for life. I want to do, I want to, I want to test this time. I'm going to switch from Zoom to StreamYard, but I'm going to put you all, and so you, this is where you can steal. I'm going to put you all in a special Facebook group that we use just for conferences. That way, the reason I wanted to do it because I wanted your chats to fly across the screen. That's, that's what made me switch it. I wanted your, I, I didn't just want you chatting. I wanted, I wanted all members and audience members to be as involved as possible, as involved as possible. So every time you say something funny or say something awesome, Ashley, you're going to be, I'm going to have you in charge of that. You know, right? You're going to, you're going to, you're going to put all that stuff on top of the screen. So that's, that's what, that's why I want to switch to StreamYard for that, because I want everyone to see y'all as it goes. Now, there are major surprises. People like Felicia Jones, entire life is going to change come this weekend. Now, I don't know if she remember. And if you do remember, don't say nothing. Keep your mouth shut. You know what I'm saying? It literally is going to change this weekend. Some of you will be in the same manner. If I were you, I would do my very best to stay focused. And I just thought about something. I just thought about something. Because... Some of you are facing this problem right now. And I had a long time ago, I did this video, or I did a class made it into a video. And someone asked me a question. Her name was Marjorie. Y'all may not remember her, but okay, you remember Marjorie. All right. Marjorie asked me a question a while ago. And it really had significant significance on that class. And I ended up talking, and it's something that we most certainly need to talk about. Oh, let me pull it up. So I'm going to pull up this video. It just this video just made its way to this meeting by accident, and I really, really want you to listen to something real quick. It's called the greatest trick of poverty. So what you're going to have my friends, is poverty is going to, if you are attached to me in any way, or if your life is about to be completely blessed, well, poverty is going to show up first. And I'm not going to explain it. I'm going to have my, I'm going to have old me explain it. Let's see if we can hear. Yeah, listen, because you suffer with this problem too. And it's not popular, what I'm about to say. It's not painful, it's not popular, okay? Mm -hmm. Marjorie, actually, I'll show you what she, I'll show you. What, what was your dream again, Marjorie? You said it so eloquently. What was your dream? To ultimately be a worldwide life transformation specialist. And my clients are leaders and um, entertainers who don't have a clue to help them to get okay. to a space that people are listening to them all the time and following them. And then we have a whole world full of people that don't have a clue. But if, we, if they're okay. getting their coaching, they, they get a clue. Yeah. Yes. Did anybody hear the light in her? Anybody heard that? You heard that? You hear? Yeah. I mean, just, just listen to it. And not, not only did she hear, um, she said that before, didn't she? Mm -hmm. she you, when she told me the first time, it sounded like she said that before. She wrote this down. <laughs> yeah, spoke with passion. She done wrote this down. She done read Think Grow Rich. 
definite purpose. You know, did the whole, whole six steps. Ladies and gentlemen, listen to me, listen to me well. Great trick of poverty is to show you money on the way to your dreams. Stop right there. I just want you to hear that one part. My friends. Jesus. My friends, my, my friends. This please so you can have it on your own. Man. The greatest trick of poverty is to show up as money on the way to your dreams. Let me, let me, let me help you out just for a second, okay? Everything is about to, to shift, to change. And some of you are looking at either the lack of money or you got this opportunity that just popped up. But this opportunity ain't got nothing to do with your dreams, but the show looks like security. Oh, they don't want to play with me, Ken. Okay. And what happens is right before you win, poverty will show up as settlement. Where's Felicia at? I dog it. And so you'll keep your eyes, you'll take your eyes off of what you're supposed to do and then settle for security and comfort or this opportunity that just popped up. And it is happening. I'm looking at it happen to y'all. And I'm telling you every single time that you're about to do something that changes the trajectory of your life. I'm not talking about hitting a goal. I'm talking about a defining moment that is so definitive that your life doesn't even look the same. A great opportunity pops up and it'll keep you on the same course instead of changing the course of your life. So you're gonna to have to decide here in the next few days, are you going to settle for that security? Or are you going to risk it all and chase every last one of those dreams? Because the greatest trick of poverty is not poverty in itself, it's to give you <clears throat> enough to keep you quiet. Two things I want to say here. One of them will come from an ancient text. One of them will come from just street smarts. They will involve you, Steve, to dissolve you. So if you start doing well, Sharon, and if you start making some noise, they'll say, run for the park board. You should be city council person. Help me somebody. You, you, you should be an assistant pastor or whatever it is that you chase it. Why? Because you're doing too much rocking the boat. And the best way for me not to have you rock the boat is to involve you. Because when I involve you, I dissolve you. Okay. Wow. <laughs> okay. That's just, that's coming from Street Smarts. I've seen it over and over. You heard it here. Wow, right? I'm telling y'all, as soon as you start getting good, they say, well, you know what? That's right, Jerry. They say, ah, oh, we got to bring Jerry in so he could be one of us so he don't stop us from getting what we always get. So they'll involve you to dissolve you. I'm telling you every single time. And that's one of the greatest tricks of poverty. You'll be like, oh man, I've got to run for this. I'm a shoot in. It'll look good on my resume. And right there, instead of you disrupting soil, you become the very soil you were attempting to disrupt. Okay, that's number one. Number two, we've got to Watch go to the tour. <laughs> we got to go to the Torah. Now, remember, I love the Torah. That, that's, that's actually my favorite. Now, there's a guy named Joseph of the, what you would call Old Testament, should you be Christian. This is strictly, I'm going to get as, as accurate to the original translation as possible. So in the Torah, in Genesis 37, you have 
Joseph. And Joseph has an issue, Arshia, because Joseph don't know how to handle his Josephness. Okay. <clears throat> Miss Evelyn Booker, I'm, I'm talking to you. He ain't know how to handle all that starness that he had. All that Josephness was too strong, so he went around telling people what he was going to do. And his brothers had their own problem. I'm going to call it brotherness. And they couldn't handle Joseph's Josephness. So what does family do? Instead of supporting the shine, they bury it. Help me, somebody. I believe I'm in some driveways right you now. You got it. Oh, okay, I'm shut up. <laughs> okay. So Joseph gets sent off. What well, first off, he they they try to kill him. Reuben steps in and say, nah, that's our brother. You can't do all that crazy stuff. Okay. Let's just sell him into slavery. Now, this is in all the Torah. There are two things that scare the crap out of me. King Saul. In the Torah, a lot, a lot of people have messed this up, but the, the people chose a king, but God chose King Saul. Okay? Literally said, look, look psh, they is right there, head and shoulders by everybody else. And what scares me about that is because God anointed someone and then took that anointing. Whew, if that don't scare you, I don't know what to tell you. I don't know what to tell you, all right? That scares me. Here's what scares me the most, the story of Joseph. I'm telling you, I, I don't fear anything but spiders in this Joseph story. There's only two things on the planet I fear, okay? There's only two things. This is what happens. Joseph gets into Potiphar's house, favored. Fine woman, that's what the text says. It got nothing to do with me, okay? Says, come here, Joseph. You're looking like some muscles, okay? <laughs> and Joseph says, no, I can't. Listen to what Joseph says. Joseph says, I can't do that. My master, talking about earthly, has put me in charge of all of this. And if I do that, I lose all of this. And I need y'all to process this information. I don't, I don't know why Felicia's on my heart. Process this information, Felicia. My master gave me all this and I can't do that because I'll lose it. Now, he still loses it, runs out his coat, gets thrown in jail for two years, but then eventually, oh, it then goes to Pharaoh's pal prison, which eventually he becomes number two in charge of all of Egypt, all the known land and Pharaoh's palace. Here's why that scares me. Because Joseph, destiny, had the palace. But Joseph was perfectly okay with Potiphar's house. Rewind, press play. Listen to what Joseph says. I can't leave this. Oh, my, oh no, I got everything I want. I don't know how to live a life to where I'm comfortable with Potiphar's house in Miss Pharaoh's palace. Didn't I tell you to watch it? <laughs> Antonio? <laughs> yes, sir. Joseph was comfortable with the prison. Oh, God. <laughs> he show up. Now you by the way, the Torah. Field? By the way, the go Torah. Go deeper, go deeper, go deeper. By the way, the Torah, that's the book that Jesus read. That's right. Absolutely. <laughs> Absolutely. Absolutely. He was comfortable in the prison, had favor in the prison. All I'm trying to do is tell you that Mexico is for the change, everything. It has to, because I got 24 years of energy in this one place. And don't settle for Potiphar's house or the prison. That, that's all I'm trying to take. That, that's all I'm trying to take, okay? I know it ain't working out the way you want it to work out. And I get that you got some stuff, but you're attempting to protect it. 
but God didn't send you to protect what you got, number one, okay? And two, God didn't send you just to be at the level you at now. That's, that's, that's not what, that's not how, that's not how they work. That's, you know, we are, we are gods. We do not settle. We risk it all. And we have dominion over it all. And then we give that away in allness to all people. That's how God works. That's what I'm talking about. That's it. <laughs> okay. <laughs> all right. That's how that works. So there's a lot. <clears throat> Let's start off with there's a bunch of special announcements that will happen. Be in tune with that. You're going to hear from Ibrahim, who is going to do the slaughter that. You're going to hear from Phil for about anywhere between 10 or 11. I'm not sure just yet, but it'll be first day, 10 or 11 o'clock in the morning. So he's around that time. One of those. So get ready because he's going to knock that out the park. <laughs> Phil, I have given you 90 minutes. Is that enough? Yeah, well, well a pro takes what you give them and deals with it. You tell me what you want. <laughs> 90 minutes. I would like to have a conversation with you, too, before we uh, just you and I talked about what your expectations are. So. Most perfect. I sure will. We'll do that today. We'll do perfect. that today. Absolutely. We'll do that today. Now, <clears throat> mix it. That being said, everything this week, except for nighttime stuff, um, let's read a book, Bureau of Dominant Speakers, that stuff, it's canceled. It's, so there's only two things not canceled. This meeting, Monday through Friday, because I still got to run a company. I still have to, if I, if I don't get in front of Grace and Monica and them field, they're going to, you know, they're going to autopilot. I don't need them autopiloting. You know what I'm saying? Right? Cause I got to, so this is, I can't cancel this. One, Cause I you need to tell them. <laughs> I need to tell them. Right? So, so the, this meeting is every day, even Friday. No, next is Friday. So no, not, not that Friday. The conference is Friday. All right. Sorry. All right. Monday through Thursday, this meeting. And then all the, you know, the, the human consultants business incubated tonight. That's that's on the all that stuff. Y'all know what I'm talking about, okay? All that stuff. Just anything in the daytime can't because computers are doing computer things and cameras are doing camera things for the last things of Mexico. The stuff that can't happen until the week before, okay? Stuff that can't happen. So that's that. Now. If I were you, I would make sure that you're friends with Ashley, friends with Monica, friends with Grace, because you're not gonna be able to get put inside the group, if not. So you might wanna make sure that happens. Yeah, what, and Tyranny and then Damali, either one of them, okay? Tyranny and then Damali, all right? So yeah, I got that, cool? Okay. So is there going to be a link for us to, to join in on? Absolutely. Okay. Yep. It's going to be a link to join in on. And then there's going to be, a, the video is going to be displayed in said place. Yep. Um, so, friends through Facebook? Yes. Yes. Thank you. Okay. Outstanding. Outstanding. And let's see. Looks like Monica just posted something in the chat. Let's see what that is. Whose profile? Oh, I think it's her profile. So that it's my profile. It sure is. Okay, well, there you go. Let's link up with her. Monica, when are you going out of town? Uh, what do you mean? Back the yeah. 28th, the 28th of May. Yeah, yeah. When you when you go to find love? That's what we ask. <laughs> took me a second. Yeah. Took me a second. Okay, yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. Twenty eighth. Yeah, we want to find that love. That's I'll it. update you. Okay, we're trying to get some of that feeling, Susan. Love. 
Yeah, yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Or, or she, she's gonna, she's gonna go investigate love. She's gonna go I investigate think. love, whether she finds <laughs> it or not. Know. That that's we'll figure it out. But right now she's in the process of investigating. That's there it. you go. Investigate. So feel say don't move too fast. Yeah, investigate, investigate. Or how long your parents been married, Grace? This is that S Mary Ann. June, June 21st. It'll be 46 years. 46 years. God. Grace and my parents are the exact same. 46 years. <laughs> Do you know how many times your mama has been mad at your daddy? In oh my God. Okay, years? wait. Yeah, okay, small story, small story. <laughs> Yesterday was Mother's Day. They're getting ready to go home. And, you know, it was church. So dad had on his nice suit. She was like, oh, your daddy look good, don't he? I dress him well. He was like, you didn't tell me. I didn't got this suit. He, he, she said, I did tell you to buy that suit. You know what he said? Yep, yep. Okay. <laughs> 46 years. <laughs> That's right. That's right. He knew to lose. That's a leave and lose. Shut your mouth and lose. <laughs> 46 years. Oh, smart man. That's smart a man. smart man. Smart man. I hope you're taking notes, Prophet Jerry. I was about to say, so this one I have to look forward to. <laughs> yes, sir. You just agree, Jerry. Hey, you just agree. Yo, yo. <laughs> you, can, <laughs> you can agree later you agree what she tell you to how about that that's it that's right Renee <laughs> you just sometimes it be, it's the it's other way around some, 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 sometimes sometimes I'll be, I'll be, I'll be like trying, all right you try to pull that that I'm the man listen to me think I ain't mad at you player you gotta do that, gotta, do that. Mm -hmm. I mean sometimes the husband is the head and we we have to be sensitive enough to see that Amen. You're talking well to me, Sadi. You are talking well. You are mm -hmm. talking well. That's it. Go you ahead, put, talk. Go ahead, go ahead. Just I'm enough, yeah, just put just enough bass in your voice, Prophet Jay. Just enough. Just, just a little bit. Then we go, okay, baby. Okay. All right. You know. <laughs> That's it. <laughs> I've never found my death wishes to me. Y'all better keep on going. Where is this Mexican going to be? Because <laughs> y'all about to kill somebody or get somebody killed. <laughs> Uh, Karen said, "Husband is the head, the wife is the neck." Never heard that before. That's actually pretty good. I have. I like that. Mm -hmm. Oh yeah, mm -hmm. that's pretty good. I've heard yeah, that. That's pretty good. Can't hold the net head up without the neck. That has some sense. That makes some sense. Well, Mister Antonio, we've been married for for forty eight years. Forty eight years. Yes. Congratulations. Congratulations. I tell you. Thank you. Wow. Thank you. Oh, welcome. Come on, y'all love me to like I'll meet you by clap for all these. Oh, um, congratulations. And then how long is it for you, Phil and Susan? 40 years. You said 40? Yeah. 40 Been years. together 40, married. That's right. Y'all okay. stuff is aligned with my age. That's right. That's right. Because I turned 40 in a month or so. So yeah, that's right. Y'all stuff. You were consultants. It's 40th year anniversary we're in. Wow. Hey, Antonio. Yes, ma'am. I'm a product of a 50 year. My parents just celebrated their 50th. Well, last year. 50. Mm -hmm. Oof, cha. Right. 50 That's still right. together yeah. and still don't like their child. Come on now. Oh, what man. is that supposed to do? You know? <laughs> <laughs> I love it. I love it. I love it. Well. It's all coming together, though. It's all coming together. It's all coming together. <laughs> They got the marriage part together. <laughs> now I guess I'm falling in line. You know, you yeah. helping me out. You helping me fall in line. They yeah, get me. That's now. good. That is good. That is good. Okay. Before I get back to Mexit, we've got uh, so Sadia, Kevin, and Felicia. All three of you will. How many leads? We got for Felicia, 750. All right, so Felicia, we got 750 people. For you that we call. I hope you don't mind. I hope you don't mind. Yeah. Not at all, sir. Okay, all right. All right, so it's okay. That was, okay, that was, that's it. Felicia, did you hear me? 
750. Yeah. I'm so sorry. I can't, I couldn't hear you. 750 leads for your thingy. You said, can I use them? No. Do you mind if we? I'll take them. I'll take them with cheese and wine and crackers. All right. So I will, I will go and, and thank God for Ashley. Ashley has been spearheading this for me. Our goal is to. Thank you, Ashley. Yes, yes. Thank you, Ashley. Now, if we, 54 is the max, right? 54 is the max for you, Felicia? Um, let's go for 60. Okay, well, let's go for 70 then. 60 is my max that I'm licensed for. Um, yeah, we'll do six, let's do 55. We'll stop it at 55. Okay, so 55 with a 10 person waiting list. How about that? Right, right, That's right. What we'll do. Yeah, we'll have them fighting to get in, fighting to get in. Cool. <clears throat> All right, so we got that. And these are because you you know, you girl, your area, you got a, you got a great area and a bad area at the same time. <laughs> you just way off in the boob docks. Way off in the boob. I almost want to go talk to that mega check church next to you and say, hey, y'all need to come over here. But they got their own kids stuff going on. Now, Sadia, you, I need Sadia. Why, why I, so I am unavailable all week, all week, but I do need to get with Sadia for about 15 minutes this week, and I need to get with Kevin for about 15 minutes this week. Just, just, just that. And of course, I got to give a feel on the mix of stuff. Okay, just that, just that. Cool. I want to. I want to give Saudi a weekly goal and I want to give, I want to, I need, I have a question or two to ask about for Kevin because Kevin has a two hour presentation he's got to do for me or do give to me. And I got some questions for that. Okay. So he's, yeah. All right, cool. So we, we good there. Outstanding. You got some, you want to say, huh? You got to say it on now. Oh, she, Korean. She keeps telling me to meet with you, send you a video. Did you send them? Yes. You said them on the mic. And Antonio? Yes, there yes, ma'am. a list of things that y'all were sending me. Remember, you were going to follow up because I still haven't gotten them? Yep, I'll Any do it other? right now. I'll, okay. do it, I'll do it in the meeting, middle of the meeting. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Korean, can you please, please send me the videos of what we talked about, mm -hmm. that really cool idea you have? Um, so we can take a look at it and I can have Antonio give you a call, please. Thank you. Who was All that right, speaking to? Korean. Okay, great. Thanks. Yes, Mrs. There is always more. Yes, her. Now, let's see. What's her name? Tempest. I'm going to get in trouble for getting Tempest's name. Okay. I know you, you did. You are. You are so in trouble. I know you lying. We got to give them grace. Grace, mm -hmm. grace on the question. It's, it's 57 names in my head right now. Okay. <laughs> I'm looking at all of them. Now it's 58. You don't forget <laughs> that one. I know. I know. I know. Well, Lisa, let me make up with the compliment I was just about to do. That's what I was just about to do, give a compliment. I want y'all to, to clap for her because she's been helping me a lot with the coding and stuff in the back. So can we please unmute our mics? All right, Tim. Yes. Thank you, thank you. Yes, yes. See, is it, is, did I do okay, Tempest? Is, does that make up for a little bit of it? Thank y'all. Yeah, I'm still sending you a message though, but uh, thank you. Uh, it I doesn't make up sense. for it. I don't care what you oh, say. Oh, there go Jerome. <laughs> <laughs> Jerome. Jerome got Tempest back all the job. time. <laughs> all the time. All the time. So Tempest has helped me a lot because, well, some stuff I just, it's more her skill sets than me. And that helps. Other stuff I needed to duplicate myself and that's what Tempest is for, right? So she she has the same skills or we're in the same skill set department. While I'm more technical, she is more organizational. She can 
she can read instructions and then do what the instructions say. Uh, Miss Booker, I'm not an instruction reader at all. I'm the reason why you say, baby, just get the map. You know, just, <laughs> just, <laughs> just, just get the map so we can stop being lost. <laughs> I'm that one. I don't do instructions well at all. I just don't. I, I don't know if my brain reads too fast so I don't care enough or I just don't like small details. I, I, it's maybe a mixture of all though. I'm more of a conceptual thinker. I know how to, I know how to look at absolutely nothing and say, huh, this is a billion dollars. Like I know how to do that very well, right? And then conceptually go out and build a billion dollar company. But if you say, okay, here's step one, I'd be like, ah, I'm bored now. I said, that's that's more of that's more of a this job. I don't do that well at all. But she's been blessing me in many areas. There are gonna be many things that you're gonna have and do. With that being said, who has been casting their nets as I have been proclaiming all year long? Anybody, anybody been casting your nets? Or working on casting your net? Because Jerome I got like, okay, good, good. Who was that, Daoud? Who was I'm that? Working on, I'm doing it. Felicia, okay, okay. Yeah. Yeah. What's casting your net? So earlier this year, I was telling everybody, because I had knew about the billion dollar valuation, I knew about what's coming, I just didn't, didn't say much. And I was telling everybody, cast your net because there's a bunch of fish out here and keep it as close to the boat as possible. And close to the boat as possible because Felicia got a big old fish in her net. By the time we done, she's gonna be the only school to blank, 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 but we can't say what the blanks are. You gotta, say, you gotta find that out on the 15th. You gotta find, that's actually Felicia's announcement well, the announcement that has something to do with Felicia is probably the second biggest Mexit announcement. Okay. Second biggest Mexit announcement. <laughs> you got me? There's one even bigger, but we'll go with that. Let me look at Luanda's message real quick. I like Luanda. Where's she at? Nope, that's not her. I have no idea where she texted me at. So while you're checking your message, let me just mm -hmm. personally say... Thank you. It feels so good to be a part of a family that supports you, that have your back, that's not intimidated by who we are as people, but love and support each other. So thank you, Antonio. This is an amazing, amazing feeling to, to, to be in such a group. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. Put, is he or she willing, <clears throat> I mean, ready to train? Put that for me, ready to change. No, thank you so much, Felicia. I appreciate you because it is, Best thing I did was put Ashley on your case. That's the best thing I did. Let me tell you, she is irritating. That's how good she is. I, you are. She is irritating. You understand what I'm saying? She, she, if I say Ashley, Sadia needs this. Ashley gonna hit you up every single day. You understand? She is irritating, <laughs> but it's good though. It's good. It's a blessing, but it's irritating. But it's a blessing. Yeah. It's yeah. a blessing. Best thing, best thing I could have did that. You will have, <clears throat> Diana will be speaking at the Mexic conference. Be ready for that, yes. And I'm not gonna tell you where she's speaking about. I'm sure she wants me to keep it secret, but be ready for that. You will see her as she is full-time CEO in now. So she gets to do what she wants to do, but she will be at the Mexic conference in all her smiling freckles. So you'll see that. You will see Tempest speaking at the Mexic conference. Yes, she will be doing some cybersecurity stuff. I won't tell you what that is. So that's there. And maybe, maybe two or three days from now, or can't even be today, the all your Dominate conference videos will be on your learning management. They already, they're, they're there already. I just haven't turned them on. But on your on your sharing our wealth, your LMS over there, 
all the days of the Dominate Conference and individual sections are there. I just wanted to wait until now I have my reasons. Everything don't make sense, but when you know the big picture and everything going on, it makes sense, okay? Everyone disagrees. Oh, Carisha, that would be amazing. Yep, <clears throat> it is there and you'll be able to see it. And then all you second day folks, should you need your individual stuff, you'll get that too, probably after the Mexic conference. And <clears throat> Tempest is telling me we need to do some reconfiguration on the cybersecurity. That's just fine with me, Tempest, that's just fine with me. I guess that's something we'll be doing this week. Cool, any questions so far? Cause I'm about to take it even higher. Any questions so far? Sandra has her hand up. Yes, ma'am, Sandra. Thank you. Um, I just had a quick question. I'm hoping that I'm not disturbing too much. I've learned a lot about myself since I've joined this family. I'm so excited. But one of the things that you asked us to think about is, um, is Facebook and Instagram, how do we get there? So I just wanted to throw this at you real quick. Just mm -hmm. ethic, ethic. What was epic? It's, no, not epic, ethic. The E-T-H-I-C. Oh, it is a it is a yellow and purple blend. It's actually yellow, which stands for all of what you are, which is amazing. Wisdom, intelligent, logic, memory, concentration, will, power, and communication. It is noted as intellectual energy and then the purple. But I just wanted to just throw that out there. There's more, but yeah. No, okay. it's dope. I appreciate you. No, I appreciate you. Now, what did you mean by how do you get on Facebook and Instagram? No, not how do you get on it. Remember the question you was asking us, how do you become, how do ATS become the bigger than the company of Facebook and Instagram. How do we get those oh, I get millions of people and over that? How do we get, how do we reach that and go over that? Because you are a interrupter, you are a <laughs> charger. So you, you, you disrupt. So to disrupt that and to go over that, that ethic, which is linked up with your July power source. Yep, smart woman. You are, so, you are, you are on. With all of that, it is doable and it is already done. Yep. That's, I just wanted to say that. No, no, understood, understood, okay. There are two books that I would read if I was y'all. If you, if you, now this is, first off, the books are hard work to read. Even if you get them on Audible and let them read it to you, you're still reading the book. And then implementing the stuff is hard work too. So just throw it out there. <clears throat> but if you do it, you will be ahead of everybody else. Fair enough. All right. The first book is called Facebook, The Inside Story by one of the greatest journalists alive. I want to say his name is Stephen Levitt. Someone double check that for me. Facebook, The Inside Story. And then the other book is called No Filter which is the Instagram story. I can't miss, it's by a, a fantastic woman. I just can't remember her name. I apologize for that. If one of y'all would Google it real quick. It's the only books called this. Facebook Inside Story. 
and then no filter is the story of Instagram. I would read Facebook, the inside story first, and then read no filter. So you can then have a lens of what happened with Facebook because a big chunk of Instagram story ends, like the second half of the Instagram story is Facebook because Facebook buys it. And that's in there. If I were you, I would read those. Side of you, <clears throat> super duper duper private conversation. But if I were someone like Sadia, and if I were someone like Felicia, and if I were someone like Kevin, I would go drop $1,000 into, write this down, S-H-I-B-A. I'm not saying this to nobody. Uh -huh. <laughs> <laughs> okay. I'm not saying this to nobody. I told Tippis, Tippis acted immediately. <clears throat> if I if I was Felicia, if I was Sadia, and if I was Kevin, I would go drop a thousand dollars into S H I B A. That's what, that's all I'm telling you. That's what I would do. What's that? What's Sheba? Morning. Ah, ah, you're a smart man. Yes, it's something that <clears throat> your mentor owns two commas, Tempest two of said cryptocurrency. Wow, this is the first day that it popped up on my top gamers. Mm -hmm. Okay. Mm -hmm. Doji. Yeah. Huh. And I've been in it for about four days. So that top yeah, that's gainer, the new big one. It's that top gainer is doing very well, <clears throat> but not just the new big one. As Monica said, I'm in the group. <laughs> I keep infiltrating these groups, y'all. <laughs> I'm in the group going, Frida, come on, push it up, push it up, y'all. I am masterfully manipulating will that's, that's okay no is, tell you. <laughs> Shiba, is it on the, the crypto.com uh, it is, app? <clears throat> it is. Uh -huh. and if i were you well this tempest do you remember what i, I told tempest something so smart tempest can you can you tell him what i told you about crow you remember that i, I said something so smart y'all i didn't even know it was smart until she flipped out about it Remember Tempest? Yeah, so crypto.com has their own coin called Cro C R O. And Antonio told me that he's investing in it because he sees crypto.com going public very soon. Okay. Be yep, I got that one last week. Okay, because they got all the crypto Coinbase does not have. Coinbase, Coinbase stock is falling. I'm not saying it's going to fall forever, but it's fall. it has fallen because all the hot things Coinbase doesn't have. Coinbase doesn't have, but crypto does. That says a lot. That says a lot. Someone just asked me, how do I make $5,000 immediately? cast your net next to Antonio is the first thing I would do. Where is this person at? <clears throat> the first thing I would do is, is Grace, unmute your mic real quick. I want you to give a testimony real quick. Yes, sir. How much money have you seen me to your best knowledge, understanding, make in 24 hours for no reason at all. 40,000. So in Grace's observation, I have made, which is true, but that's not the most, but there you go. $40,000 in 24 hours. I would cast my net next to someone who could do that. 
Okay, yeah, I missed. Can I tell you some street smart stuff? Do you, do you mind if I tell you some street smart stuff? Okay, tell you some street smart stuff. The way the world worked now, y'all may not like what I'm about to say, but it's still street smart. Chocolate covered folk had these pyramids up there, Miss Booker. There's some good pyramids. Oh man, they did that. None chocolate covered folk came and said, them some nice pyramids. Them folks said, hmm, them our pyramids now. And ever since, it's been they pyramids. There's a lesson in that. Let me reverse that story and tell you what y'all would do today. You would say, huh, them some nice pyramids. Everybody's getting attention. You know what we should do, Kevin? We should go over there and build our own pyramids to rival those pyramids. Why would you do that? Why would you waste all those resources? Why would you take 400 years to catch up? Somebody missing it. <clears throat> okay. Black folk, because it was a black person asking me this question. Why would you try to make $5,000? That's your number one flaw. That's not how it works. You're already 17 generations behind. So what I would do is I'd put 17 people in one house. Watch this here. 17 people and yes, I sure did. I sure did, Susan. I sure the heck did. And that amount right there, yep, I sure did. But hold on, it should be, should be, hold on, hold on before I finish my thought. Somebody give me the call letters for Shiba. Is it S H I B? Is it just H A? Is it yes? Yeah. Yes, it, it is. Yep. Yep. Shiba, Shiba I N U. Yep, that's it right there. Yep, that's it. Shiba I N U. That's it right there. S H I B A, right? Yes, that's the full name of it, but the call letters are S-H-I-B. Yes, ma'am. Okay, now the, there's a story behind Sheba, if I remember, I'll come back to it. The, oh, black people. What I would do, Grace, is I would tell the private messenger who private messaged me, hey, Why not 17 of us move in one house? And this is what we'll do, Dr. Booker. What we'll do is <clears throat> one month, everybody, everybody, one family is responsible for all the bills, no matter what it costs. The next 16 months, no bills to be paid. We'll rotate paying bills per family per month. Do you understand? how quickly you would catch up if you just stopped trying to make $5,000 and start looking at pyramids and saying, hmm, the mind now. One culture says, huh, that's ours now. The other culture says, huh, let's keep creating. The rest of the world does that. If y'all get together, just imagine if some of y'all get income tax. I ain't had one of those in 10 years, no, 12, 12 years. Some of y'all get income tax. Just imagine if 12 of y'all got $5,000 a piece and then y'all moved in together, $60,000. But then it's only 12 months out the year. So that means you're only paying bills once. The rest, you just stack in your paper. But Ken, I can't get people to work together and say, that's my pyramids. And Antonio, you know why? Why is that? Here in America, we have a lack of trust because we don't have a history of familial support 
And so because of that, there's a lack of trust. And I can't trust that in six months, you're going to be here to pay your bills. So if I pay them now, I'm going to get duped. Mm, mm, mm. Hey, T. You show speaking, Sadia. you. Yes, sir. Yeah, in addition to what Sadi was saying, I, I think based on my observation over the years, people don't understand the real why. Mm, that is accurate. There's no possible way I could disagree with that. Impossible. Yeah, the game. Yes, sir. Sadia did a great job on Thursday night. I just like to give her some props there. She yes. she was just she knows her stuff. That's for sure. <laughs> <laughs> yes, she does. I was in the back ear hustling the whole time. <laughs> yes, she did. Yes, she did. That was excellent. As a matter of fact, to, yeah, yeah, go ahead, Sadi. Thank you for the opportunity. Oh, you're fine. very welcome. Yes, you're very welcome. Yes, I, she's going to be doing some stuff with that. Yes, she's going to be doing some stuff with that. Fantastic, fantastic. Let me wrap this up real quick. Felicia, I just sent you a text message that should help you out a lot. Did that help you? Okay, there you go. How you make $5,000, I would attach them myself to someone that has $5,000 or more and then ask them to, hey, can I work for you? And then keep this amount and bring you new customers. That's the fast way to get $5,000. Don't start with an empty cup and try to fill it. Start with an empty cup, get next to an overflowing cup and stand next to it. Those are two different mindsets. Say it again, Antonio. Yes. Okay, don't start with <laughs> yeah, don't start with an empty cup and try to fill it. Start with an empty cup, get with some overflow, and then fill it up that way. So you should attach yourself to someone that makes more than five thousand dollars and say, Can I bring you free customers while you give me a commission until it gets to five thousand? Because now you don't have to worry about a product and you don't have to worry about marketing and you have someone else's energy and reputation. It's so easier to sell Exxon than it is to sell your gas company. Right? And feel free that, to use my over, overflowing cup, just so you know. Okay, then. so there you go. Sadia, Sadia, I tell you what, if y'all want $5,000, if anybody wants $5,000, then contact Sadia, she gets you some, some regulations and some standards and boom, she will pay you commission. They ain't know when to shout. Y'all must be church folk. Church folk never know when to shout. Okay. All right. <laughs> <laughs> Thank my you, damn, you Thank button is stuck, everything. I'm like, damn, what? I'm about to call Sadia myself. I didn't it's even it. Is her info? Is her info in the chat? Sadia, so give out your information. Thank you. Okay, she says she put it in the chat. All right, so that is almost it. Yes, that is, I'm reading these private messages. Yes, you can, private messenger. And private messenger, I also will hook you up with a few things. There you go. They can send interest in working with you to T. T is tyranny. All right, so if you want to work with, this is what this I'm gonna do. If you wanna work with Antonio, I'm gonna automatically force you to work with Sadia. How about that? Okay, it's automatic, but it's two for one. You get two for one, all right? We both got companies <laughs> that can pay out a lot of money. So it's two for one. So if you apply, this way we, we, can we send them to one place, send everybody to one place, where they wanna, we'll send you to two places. Go directly to Sadia or y'all just contact Tyranny directly. Tyranny, when they, is she on the call? Tyranny, when they contact you, that's two for one. That's automatically side of your side is going to need that information. So establish a, a relationship with side of you right now. Cool? There it is. All right, so can last I jump in? <laughs> yeah, no, that's right. I ain't mad at you. <laughs> I still need teachers. I still need teachers. If still anybody is to. looking for a job, grandmamas, actually youth, if your children are 16 or older and they need a summer job, I'm going to be hiring um, student aides for the summer as well. Mm. Okay, I'm going to keep that in mind. I got some Please. I, boys. I'm, 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 I'm hiring boys and girls, young students, because they'll be helping us with the field trips. That is dope. That is dope. Okay. Well, Antonio, may I say something real quick? Yes, ma'am. Um, now, please note that if anybody knows anyone that has big groups or individuals that's ready to travel, Kingdom Travels do give between three to five percent commission if they book their group. Uh, they do get 
you know, money back from the group that they referred or the person or families that they refer for any type of travel services. Outstanding. Well, thank you. Thank you so much. So y'all make sure that Kingdom Travels is the best thing that has happened to my travel affair. You understand? Thank God for Kingdom Travels. I'm telling you, I'm so excited about Kingdom Travels. I will continue to use Kingdom Travels. And Sadia's company is so impressive. I got big plans for her company. That's all I'm gonna say right now. It's too too much. Yeah, yeah. It's just, I can't say too much right now. I got big plans, the big plans. And she is a woman of class. I was looking for a few of the words, but class sums it up. She is a woman of class and the law of attraction is very strong with her. I'm not sure if y'all know what I'm talking about, but money just knocked down doors to find Sadia. And I like folk like that. That's it, Thicky Girl Rich, okay? Some folk are just lucky and you need to just go ahead and attach yourself to them. Actually, I'm not even sure that's a Thicky Girl Rich. It's another book I read, but I'm serious. And Sadia is one of those lucky people that no matter where she go, stuff just work out. Whenever y'all find them, don't go try to create your own luck. That's your pyramid now. Nah. Hey, Sadi, what's going on? Um, <laughs> I'm trying to tell y'all. Have the, the fact that's a great way to end. Mexit two, I think, actually, I think one, hold on real quick. I think one person bought a Mecca ticket twice. Um, Tawala Garner. I think you bought your ticket twice. Twice. Did you mean to buy two or did you mean to buy one? Where is she at? I'll find out. Okay. If she's not on the call, I'll find out. Okay. It. Okay. Appreciate you. I'll find out. Okay. Appreciate you. If not, we will immediately refund her ticket. If, if, if she meant to just do it once, we will immediately refund it. Okay. I'll let her know. That's okay. okay. No, she's on my team. Okay. Good. Good. Go ahead, Sadia. Mm -hmm. People are sending me their numbers. If you all could just text me your information, we can set up a time to talk. That would be awesome. That'll work. That'll work. Text the information that's out there. Copy and paste that. There it is. And all right, everybody. So let me say these last words because I've got stuff to do. If I was Kevin Sadia. And Felicia, okay, I would drop thousand dollars, okay, in Toshiba, and I would hold. I'm about to do it right now. <laughs> <laughs> I'm at the bank. <laughs> <laughs> I know that's right. Listen, the goal is to get to a billion shares. There's yeah. no other goal. If you get to a billion share, Tempest, where you at? I'll meet your mic. Hello. Tell them what. Tell them if what happened if they get to a billion shares. Tell them. A Sheba. Mm hmm. You are an instant millionaire. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Thank you so much, Tempest. You speak so well. You just You're speak. Welcome. You speak so well. Sheba is. So Sheba is a. They listened. That they did not listen. Remember, I told y'all about. Dogecoin at point zero zero five. Okay, well, let me say this real quick. If y'all not gonna listen, let me say it this way. I put in <clears throat> X amount of dollars in Saturday night and I just checked my um, portfolio and my money has doubled in 48 hours. Okay, Tippis, who, who called you and told you put in money? You did. The person who didn't call me, shall I? <laughs> I need that's to be right. on that list, okay? I know that's right. Yes, ma'am. You are on that list. It's fourth. Yeah. <laughs> it's fourth. This is what's happening. <laughs> you mean to who got all these messages and nobody bothered to copy and paste that part? Oh, okay. You're right. Ah, uh, that's uh, okay. Somebody else said me too. Yes, I got you. <laughs> is, that, ah. is that is that the Shiba I N U? Is yep. that the one? That's it. Okay. That's it. That's it. Hold. Hold. 
You understand? And that's at like 0.00001453 something. It's crazy. Right but time. No doubt. Right timing. The reason why it's been out. It's not just new and hot. It's been in Europe, period. It can only be traded through one platform. But I've been, I'm in the group and they're attempting to push it to pass a dollar. It's an experiment that is to take on Dogecoin. Yeah. Okay. Well, Tonya, whenever you have something like that, can you have the girls to post it in the group? I may not have a thousand dollars, baby, but I know how to build that set, my money up to invest in whatever everything that you tell us to invest. Oh, got you, got you, got you. <laughs> Tim and Tom very bad hair up. So that's there it is. Look at that. Kevin Vaughn just posted it. Y'all see that? Y'all see that? Antonio. Right. Yes, sir. So they're using guerrilla marketing too, because they're using the Shiba, the Shiba Inu from the Dogecoin as the name of their 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 currency. It's called Shiba. So they, yeah. they're actually stealing a little bit from them too. That's smart. That's that you, you, you got it. <laughs> you got it. Okay. Always follow attention. Always follows attention. Now Ashley is telling me to go because we got something to do. Always follow attention. Always follow attention, y'all. Please, 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 please. That's I have one thing. more question. Yep. Can I borrow a thousand dollars? That's a good question. I'll pay you back. I'll pay you back. <laughs> you sure will if I get... <laughs> that is a good okay, question. Tanya. Yes, ma'am. Um, could somebody let, reach out to me. I'm trying to avoid the bank, which takes two to three days to transfer my money to crypto. Yeah. And so I see on the internet that I can use my debit card, but I can't figure that out. Got you. Okay. You got that. All right. Damali. Yeah. Yeah. Damali, somebody, right. Yeah. Call me on that too. Cause I'd rather do the debit card than trying to transfer it. It took my seven days. I haven't, I haven't been through that process yet. Has anyone used a source other than waiting for their bank to send it? Yeah, I, I, I use, use my debit card. Yes, I, I use, use my debit card. card. It was real yes. easy on the app. To yeah. Use debit card if you're on crypto.com. I just need somebody to call me to tell me how to do oh, just right. that. Well, Demi, I'm about to figure it out because I'm about to I'm about to figure it out because I'm about to use my debit card. Some, so I have All to right. figure so, it out. Who's Monica, hey. can you help me with that, hey. Monica? Yeah, yeah, because I use my debit card. Thank you, Monica. Yeah, definitely. Somebody was trying to get my attention. I heard a hey. Yeah, okay. it was me. Oh, I'm yes, saying, Terry. Um, I was told by another person that utilized their debit card, if you call your bank ahead of time and let them yeah. know what you're trying to do because it's a transaction that's going out of country or something like that, let them know ahead of time. They'll give you like a 30-minute window to make the purchase. Theirs yeah, was, was a, just, a credit union, you know. Yeah, I was just going to tell you, I was actually going to say that. Actually going to say that. So good oh, stuff. No, and no. Some banks said it better than me. Some banks won't support buying crypto either. Just so don't wait till the last minute if you're going to try to do something. Um, some of the banks are have put policies in place where they'll deny the the actual transaction if they know it's a crypto company. I go through that now. I have to ask for permission every time. Yeah, a credit a union question. is best. You just can't use your credit card through that credit union. It has to be a debit card linked through that credit union. You shouldn't have any problems. I had a quick question. Yes, quick question. Yes. Um, are oh, we Pat, using exchanges? Yeah, how you doing, sir? Doing good. Are we using exchanges? Is I, use a I use crypto.com. Okay. For that very reason. I am, I, I got, so I didn't get lucky in picking the right app. Coinbase just went public first, right? I, I do the work and find out which app works best for everybody. And crypto.com is one I personally use. It is okay. an exchange, but it is an extremely good exchange. It also has money in the game because they got their own crypto coin as well. So I use that personally. Okay. Well, yes. Uh, you you make the real money, so uh, 
that's the exchange. So, <laughs> <laughs> but so uh, just uh, because when they're saying the fees and the banks and stuff like that, absolutely, uh, there are uh, other exchanges out there. And, you know, I use a couple of exchanges and I use PayPal uh, with it. So I have a way of pushing my money in and out kind of cheaper and quick and faster. So for nice. instance, if I want, say I want a couple of grand, within minutes, I get a couple of grand. I want a couple of grand in, within minutes, I put a couple of grand in. And so I'm not sure if when they were talking about thousands, that's different when you're talking about millions, hold on, wait a minute. But for the smaller exchanges, you can avoid some of the fees and you can get your money like this. Okay, so yeah, I'll read, contact Pastor Barlett. Yeah, I read something about using PayPal and that you shouldn't be doing that. So for, Bit, for Bitcoin, PayPal, you don't really own the coins. Right. Not, right. not on buy it with PayPal. What I do, here's real quick, and he mentioned uh, yeah. Coinbase and Coinbase has some issues. So I'll, I'll just, I have a Hong Kong exchange. I take that money from the Hong Kong exchange. I send it over to Coinbase because it's the U.S. Oh, company. Yeah. Then I transfer the money straight into PayPal instantaneously. So I don't yeah. have to worry about anything or anything like that. I yeah. just move my money just at ease. But that's, those are lower amounts and you do have some limits. It may be around 20 to 30 grand or something. So Absolutely. if you're messing around with the thousands of dollars, you can move that quickly. Now, if you're talking about millions, that's a whole different story. Absolutely. Absolutely. Well, funny, yes, ma'am. Have you heard of the military software, the P-A-L-A-N-T-I-R, military software? I believe so. Yeah, they, some have said it was used to find bin Laden. But my cousin, I was talking to him about investments and everything Saturday night. He's pretty big at it. He works with um, General Mattis. And some, General Mattis is the one who told him to invest in that. And he, he works with a lot of the big name millionaires, billionaires, and they tell him where to invest. So I didn't know if you had done anything with that. No, ma'am, I sure haven't. What, what I, no, no, that's fantastically smart. I, I wish I would have thought about that. What I have done is, what I've done well is I'm always at the beginning of stuff. That's, I've kind of got that Gary V in me. I know when something's going to be hot before other people know it's going to be hot, right? You know, because I'm paying attention to people and people are my mentor. So wherever there is a, extreme gathering of people paying attention to something i'm there first and one of my most fantastic sources is forums to find us out because people hang on weird people like me hang on forums quora reddit etc it's not the only place but there you go so i pay very close attention to that and i've been watching there's another one uh phil actually messaged me this morning there's another one that just hit a dollar. Oh, let's see. Somebody just asked, should I use 1,000 from my Doge and put it in the Shiba? That's actually pretty smart. That's actually pretty smart. And you can just come back to Doge if you want to. That doesn't mean, have, have I dumped my Doge? No, no, not at all, not at all. But if you're gonna take a chance like that, you would take it on Shiba. That, like that's actually sound intelligence. It is. It's sound intelligence. You'll miss the though the Shiba. If you got it, yeah. If you if you got it, or you can take your Bitcoin or Ethereum to Shiba. You can sell it to it to it. That's actually smart. I'm not telling you to do it. If but if you don't have any money or enough wow. money, you okay. get what I'm saying? Yeah. Or you know, just but you, basically what you're asking is, Antonio, should I sell one that would make me six figures for one that can make me a millionaire? The, the answer is obvious, right? I mean, <laughs> should I go to the one that's not even close to a penny yet? Yeah, you should. Absolutely, you should. Because by the time it get to a tenth of a penny, you, I don't know quadrupled your money or something i'm not sure it's crazy though whatever it's going to be so that's basically what you know what what the person is asking they just send me you're very well based what the person's asking 
get to, I've, I've got to go, but most certainly do that. This is just, this is now five months from now, I'm gonna come back and say, hey, remember when I told y'all and everybody's gonna be like, Ugh. so this time I know for sure Kid Johnson didn't hurt me. <laughs> I don't know, nobody else heard me. I know Ken Johnson heard me this time. <laughs> Ken came to me last week and was like, man, I got to confess. I, I, I went, not this time, though. I know Ken Johnson hit me. I know he does, without a doubt. Make sure. Oh, yeah, you- I'm working. I'm working magic now. I'm working magic now. <laughs> That's it. That's it. That's it. They say I heard you too, without a doubt. And then, oh, I was going to give you one more. There's another one. Hold on, real quick before that I have gone hard on to feel like she texted me about it this morning with another five. Hold on, let me show it to y'all. Give me a second. Let me tell it to y'all. Let me go. I can't find it. Oh, there. All right, there we go. Uh, Matic is this, it's this letters. M-A-T-I-C, Matic, yes. Polygon, yes. Okay, yeah, man. <laughs> Pastor Barlett must got some. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. <laughs> I already made some change on that one. I'm glad you told me that. I'm going okay. back for it. I'm going yeah, back for it. Yeah, buddy, go back for it, man. It's hot. I'm in that. I'm in that community too. It's it's hot, hot fire, hot fire. Thank y'all, everyone. I appreciate you. It's been my pleasure. Dominic, text me right after this, and I'll answer your question via text message. I appreciate y'all so much. And Ashley is pulling my chain to get out. Of it. Yes, that's it. Those are the letters right there. Those are the letters right there as well. Can you spell other coin? It's M A T I C. M A T I C. I will. Antonio. Yes, I, ma'am. I just figured it out on the debit card. So if Sadia calls me, I could show her. It, I'm not sure. All you got to do is tell your bank, and then they should approve. They probably hit you with, with fraud and they try to protect you. All you no, no, do I just it. figured it out how to pay it via the um, debit card. And I was telling, oh, wanted you to reach out. Yeah, I, I'm doing it like right now. Yeah, and I left oh, information shoot. in your, um, I left information in the chat for you to study on how I did it. So I don't know if that's Good. gonna help you or not, but hopefully. Sadia like me, <laughs> Sadia you. got a couple of, Sadia oh. risky. She, she gonna drop a couple grand. She, I, I already know what she gonna do, what she gonna do. So, so listen. If with Sheba, there's only one play. There's only one play. Focus on 15 million at a time until you get to a billion. That's the play. Focus on what? 15 million Shebas at a time. Right now, it should cost you about four something, 474. If you can't do that, don't worry about it. Just know you're just going to keep nickel and diamond until you get to 15 million. And you're going to have 15 million increments all the way up to a billion. And when you get those B, you sit yourself down, okay? And you hold, it ain't gonna take long. It ain't gonna take long with 15 million and you just hold and you hold. And then you're gonna be one of them stories that they say, crypto millionaire, right? And it's gonna say, Damali, dual citizen, right? Crypto millionaire, Sadia. Yeah, it's gonna say that, okay? That's what's gonna happen and it's gonna be you. I'm not telling y'all what I think. I'm telling you what I'm doing. You understand what I'm saying? I'm telling you what I'm doing. So take screenshots of this one, because this is directly from my phone. Take screenshots of this one, and then I can get out of here. I just want to I'm give you the information, because there's no, there's no Friday crypto class. And I'm trying to bless you, right? Because there's no Friday crypto class. So, and then this ain't the kind of news you want to wait till Friday for. <laughs> sure. yeah. Right, because I'm seeing crypto news reports released two hours ago about Shiva. So if they release some articles about it, you might want to go ahead and execute right now. I was on it four days ago. Okay. I'm trying to, I can't even show the picture ain't even showing because my computer is doing so much. Sure. I yes, I do I do have everything, Felicia, and I have sent it. I would check on it for you today. Uh, yeah, I'll check on it for you today. Yes, that's only Grace. And then uh, Antonia, I'm sorry. I'm going to call you as well because I do want to do this, Sheba. Got you. But I'm going to need your help on this one. Understood. Understood. I'll be ready for you. All right, this is poly, uh, Polygon Matic right here. So y'all take a screenshot. Cool. 
five, four, three, two, all right, there we go. All right, go ahead, Grace. I'm sorry. Oh, no problem. Uh, ladies and gentlemen, Mexit is Friday. It begins Friday. I know three people who are having their shirts be sent to them this week. In fact, hold on. Do, you know what you do, Grace? Do, let me, I'm, I'm going to leave, Grace. You handle that news, okay? And Tanda, and then you end it. Tell them about the Mexican shirts. Tell them about everything. And then I'm going to leave so I stop getting in trouble with Ashley. Okay. Um, the Mexican shirts um, are available. Um, you tell us the color shirts that you want. We have them in black and white, but if you want a different color, you can. It's just going to cost you a little extra, just a little extra. Shirts are $20 plus tax, and every X is a dollar more, okay? Every X is a dollar more. Uh, what we need, if you send me a text message or send me a message, a smoke signal, whatever, I'm going to put my, my number in the chat. <laughs> Let's see. That's me. So if you send me a text message saying, hey, this is my name, this is my phone number, this is my email address, this is the size shirt I want, this is the color shirt I want, um, and give me your mailing address because I can't get the shirt to you if you don't give me a mailing address, okay? <laughs> I got to ship it to you, okay? I will send you an invoice for the price of the shirt. And once the invoice is, is cleared, your shirt is like, it's like we don't make it till you order it, okay? So we the same way. And uh, Pastor Steven is getting his shirt. Uh, Miss Adonia is getting her shirt. And Romy Rome is getting his shirt. I'm, mail I'm putting them in the mail today, sir. So you will have them before the Mexican conference. If you right. want them, you want to make sure you get you get your orders in by Tuesday, Tuesday, because if Wednesday is kind of pushing it, it kind of takes two days to get to you. So Wednesday is really the cutoff day. I heard someone say something. Dr. Ken. I know. I'm sorry if I did. Oh, okay. Not a problem. All right. So my number is in the chat. Please send me a text message saying, hey, this is what I want. This is my mailing address. Yeah. Shirt size. I need, I'll have you tell me your name if I don't have your number, please, because I won't know who that is. So <laughs> tell me your name, number, email address, your shirt size, the shirt color, um, and your mailing address. So that way we can have everything to you. Thank you so much. Anybody have any questions? Before we hang up, before we leave, I just want to shout out to Serafia. This is one of her bonnets. And I want to give a good shout out to Sandra. This is one of her jewelry pieces that was sent over the weekend and uh, it came and I have all of the other ladies jewelry to bring and I will bring it Wednesday night to Houston. But Sandra, this is one of her pieces, very beautiful. And Serafia, this is one of her bonnets and this is another one. And, oh, you can't see it, be, oh, anyway, there's another one. It has uh, sugar spices written on it on the back and they are totally reversible. I know you can't see that because of my green screen, but very, very good quality, very well made. So group up economics, remember. All right, ladies and gentlemen. Also, Antonio is on Miss Maxine Phillips uh, show this evening, 5.15 Eastern time, so it's 4.15 p.m. Central time and 2.15 Pacific Standard Time. So let's show up, show out, and show our support for that this evening. Going to be great, as always. And so let's show our love. And she put her information in the chat to where you can get to her Facebook page. All right, ladies and gentlemen, thank you so much. You can plan better. You can tonight. dominate. Everyone. Oh, also, tonight, uh, the Human Consultant Show with Phil and Susan Sorrentino. Go ahead, sir. Yeah, we'll be finishing uh, the last two steps, the 11 steps to be reliant, and then we're going to talk about gratitude and relationships. All right, sir. Well, 7 p.m. Central, 8 p.m. Eastern, 5 p.m. Pacific. Everyone, take care. Hey, Sorrentino, can you drop that info in my chat for your class tonight? Oh, I'll get it to you, Mr. Ron. Yes, thank you. You're very welcome. All right. Everyone, y'all there? All right. Love you. Love you more. Love you, Love you more. more. Love you more. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.